Good morning, day 24. I was just thinking about this literally just a second ago. It is unbelievable that I've, not unbelievable, it's pretty amazing that I've made it this far. I haven't come this far in a, uh, in my, like, a change of eating habits since I was probably about 16 years old. Um, so it's been a long time. I'm about to be 25 in February, so many years, and I'm so freaking proud of myself for going this long with, like, you know, staying on one path for this long. Almost a month, you guys. We're a week shy of a freaking month. <sighs> it's pretty amazing. I'm feeling anxious to weigh myself on the 15th and very nervous because I, you know, I don't want to um, see something not in, you know, not of like a, you know, I'm hoping that I lost some good weight, you know, I'm, I'm really hoping. I haven't weighed myself yet, so, um, but... Yeah, uh, anyway guys, I gotta make my breakfast. It says I'm supposed to have, well, I wrote down that I was supposed to have an omelet, but I'm not really feeling an omelet. I think I'm just gonna do a shake. So, today is a shake, and I decided I'm not even gonna bother making myself a little meal plan calendar. I already have it written down in my little booklet, so I'm gonna keep my booklet right there, and when the day goes by, or when it's the next day, just turn the page. So. Anyway, today's breakfast of the Herbal Life Shake. Oh yeah, by the way, I hope you guys enjoyed our vlog yesterday. Um, and today we're going to be doing a take two of attempting to go bowling. So let's hope that goes well. Malcolm is um, at a football game playing for charity. Um, I'm, I can't remember what charity it is, so I don't want to say yet just because I don't want to be wrong. Um, uh, but when he gets back, I'll have him tell you guys about how the games went. It's like a, a tournament or something like that. Um, so, yeah. Malcolm loves playing football, too, so I know that he's really enjoying it. Um, okay, so I'm going to get my shake going. I... I have to apologize for my camera like I really don't like this is a new camera and it is always focused obviously you guys see what I'm talking about but all right enough shake time okay so Malcolm just uh, sent me a message text message saying he's on his way home he should be here in about 15 minutes so <clears throat> I'm going to get his lunch started too and today he's going to be having uh, roasted chicken, sweet potato, and broccoli. So I'm making his broccoli now. I already have the chicken done and um, the sweet potato. So really all I have to do is heat that up. Um, so yeah. Then hopefully we can go bowling. I hope so. We'll see how he feels because he, he's been gone since like eight something this morning and it is already won something so playing football for that long I know he's probably gonna be a little tired maybe a little sore so we'll see but hopefully more than likely he's gonna want to go so all right guys I will check in when he gets back so here's my lunch you guys already know what it looks like but I thought I'd show you again this is literally one of the most delicious lunches and you know portobello mushrooms are very filling too so all right time to eat and Malcolm should be home within the next few minutes so yeah I'm gonna scare Malcolm ah! okay that didn't so tell me how it went and what did you do? Score all these touchdowns. Welcome home, by the way. Yeah, so it was good. It was a good tournament for special needs kids, but uh, it's 
special kid, special, yes. special Olympics, special, yeah, I think special Olympics. Yeah, it was raised money for them. Um, I think like five hundred dollars for each kid supports them through the, I guess, training mm -hmm. up to that point. Um, That's it's a good tournament, but it was poorly organized. Like you, you would think, you know, for being for a big cause, it would be better, more, yeah. better organized. Like the guy that was running was like. Like a seventeen-year-old kid, uh, the brackets were all messed up. So, but it was for a good cause. It was for a good cause. It was fun. I had a good time, but it should have been a little bit more organized. Did it. you play with anybody who plays on your other f uh, football no. team? No. How did you find out about this? You know. Anyways. You know a good player. So what know, are we doing? Are we going bowling today? I'm thinking about going bowling. Today. So. The plan was to go bowling, but again, plans have changed. All of these freaking bowling alleys in this area are doing uh, the bowling league anytime between like 5.30 and 6, and then there won't be available lanes until like 10 o'clock at night, and that's not working for us, so. Canceled bowling, we decided we're going to order the movie. Jurass the Jurassic World and make some spicy popcorn and we're going to actually go to Target and grab Malcolm some headphones for his um, Xbox so <sighs> really kind of sucks like the only time that we could really go freaking bowling is during the weekdays it's very weird because you would think that Friday Saturday even Sunday would be you know good for families to go bowling and you know like where I'm from late at night on the weekend they would do so, uh, like cosmic bowling which was like between 9 30 and 10 they'd have you know the lights turned off and cool little lights going and music and stuff but mm, can't really do that with Nyla you know that's kind of late for her so anyway guys off to Target we go to Target we go to Target we go our favorite store. <laughs> Seriously, we just got good front door parking and this place is packed too. So we got lucky, Malcolm. Here we are. Target! <laughs> Favorite area. TVs, electronics. Malcolm got a bad cart. He got a dud. You got a dud. I had to give Nyla to him because I'm telling you, she is freaking heavy. Oh my gosh, this cart this makes lots of noise, huh? Find now in the Christmas area. Look how big that freaking wreath is. How freaking cute. And then they have a bunch of stuff on sale for uh, the Halloween stuff that didn't sell. Down over there figuring out what our christmas tree is going to be he's going to want to get a new skirt for his christmas tree too so what do you think a silver skirt tree skirt that looks too small oh my god that thing's tiny 
You're gonna need a new tree skirt, I was just thinking. <laughs> so, alright guys. Target trip is coming to an end. We will probably be leaving here within a few minutes. Okay, so, let me get under the light. We finished in Target, we got a few goodies, and now we're heading home. We're gonna have movie night and popcorn, and just hang out as a family, because clearly bowling just is not working out for us. At home, and I kinda wanna show you guys what we got. Little, you know, little goodies and stuff. So, uh, Malcolm got chips for tomorrow for football and some sea salt popcorn for tonight for our movies so we're at target you guys obviously seen um malcolm and i have like shot a massive shot glass collection like if you guys want to see it let me know because it's we have a lot of shot glasses so we added to our shot glass collection we got a naughty and nice i gotta peel these things off though shot glass little santa beard one Cute, huh? Um, so we're every year we do um, Christmas pictures. So we got little mugs for our Christmas pictures. Um, it's cute. It has the little chalkboard front. Got two of them. Um, and those were in like they're you know when you first walk into Target the little cheap area. So of course we always send out Christmas pictures and Christmas cards. So we got our Christmas card for that. And then, I like, I had to get these little gold buckets. I'll figure out something to do with them. So, that is that. And then, um, oh yeah, Malcolm got, because uh, every year we rotate uh, who gets to choose the decorations for um, the Christmas tree. Malcolm's doing the Cowboys colors. So, uh, blue, silver. So, we got some more ornaments for that. We have, we have a bunch of silver ornaments too, and I'm going to spray paint pine cones silver and blue, and we'll use it for the tree too. Then he got these little ones. Whoopsie. And then he got, sorry guys, then he got his headphones for his PlayStation. Or, uh, what the hell is it? Xbox One. Sorry guys. Then I told you chips and popcorn, so. Uh... We love going into the Target. You know, Malcolm and I, we always used to go to the store, you know, before we had Nyla and stuff. We are always going to the store. We are always always going and doing things, you know, always going to do things. And we would always go to the movies and stuff. Now it's like it's a treat to us because we don't really do it a lot, you know, just because we have Nyla. And Nyla is a tough one. She has a little temper. So, yeah. But anyway, I'm going to get dinner going, and I will be back with you guys shortly. Bad guys. Okay. So, just finished Malcolm and my, Malcolm's dinner and mine dinner. I'm going to show you what it looks like. So, Malcolm's trying something new for the first time tonight. White asparagus. A little roasted chicken. And brown rice. Of course, the new... Thing that he's trying is the white asparagus and then i'm having a roasted cauliflower steak with roasted eggplant and chickpeas so there's grumpy girl right there literally she is a grumpy girl so anyway guys thank you very much for sticking with me through this journey and I will be back tomorrow for day 25. Freaking crazy. So, all right. I hope you guys have a good night. And I will be back tomorrow.